My name is Christina Richards, and I'm auditioning for Arabella. Okay. Ready? Action. Hey, Joe, have you seen Arnell? He's supposed to meet me to give me the keys to his car, but he didn't show up, and I've been kind of worried about him. Okay, can you cut there? Can you engage yourself with her instead of just sitting, like, no, reading? reading to you. Yeah, okay. So, Sorry. so you can just kind of really look at her. If you could come a little, a little closer to the camera, Diane. Yeah, just so she can look this way. Thank you. Okay. okay. Hey, Joe, have you seen her now? He's supposed to meet me to give, the key, give me the keys to his car, but he didn't show up. I've been kind of worried about him. What is he doing? Arnell. Arabella, come here. What? I'm kind of worried about him, too. Don't yell at him. He's acting so strange lately. Like, what's he doing sleeping on the bench? He was going to give you his car? Okay, I think we need to talk to him. I think we need to see if anything is up, like why he's been acting differently lately, his sleeping pattern, and why he would be wanting to give away his car. Where's your gym teacher? Why don't we ask him to talk to her now? I think we should just have a talk with him first and see what's up. Besides, Mr. Smith is out with students snowshoeing right now. Hi, Arnold. Hey, Arnold. Wake up. You're in gym. Oh, hey, you guys. What's up? Hey, buddy. What's going on? Nothing. Why? What's wrong with you? Arnold, Joe's worried about you, and I'm worried about you, too. Why are you sleeping in gym? <laughs> I'm good, you guys. I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, Arnell, can I ask you something? I'm worried about you, man. You've been different. You haven't been coming out to hockey, and, well, now you're going to give your car to Arabella? What's up with that? Arnell. Hey, Arnell, I have to ask you, man. Are you thinking about suicide? Arnell, I'm really worried about you. I know this is such a difficult time for you at this time of the year. Man, you might punch me for this one, but I'd rather you be mad at me than something happening to you. Well, it is the anniversary of your mom's passing, and it's totally understandable that this would be the worst time because you're losing your mom is painful and you're grieving. Your mom is such a kind, fun person. Want to sit down and talk? I took the mental health first aid workshop they had at the rec center last month. I just need to ask you these questions because I care about you, ma'am. Are you thinking about committing suicide? I can't sleep at night. I've been so sad, man. I think about her all the time. With my dad working at construction camp, I'm just so lonely. I feel like such a wuss that I'm so mixed up. Did you have a plan for the suicide? My dad's away and we have our shotgun, so I thought it would be so easy and he wouldn't have to find me. I know, what? Then we'll stop there. Okay.